yourself, why didn't I think of that? I know you have, haven't you? Yes. Well, when you see people who become successful from wacky ideas, well, my next guest, Ken Delmar, spent years trying to break out as an artist, but it was an accidental discovery that finally got the art world to take notice. Take a look at this. Meet Ken Delmar. He always dreamed of being an artist. Even when his work was rejected, it didn't stop him. And last year, he finally made it big. I'm still in shock. And like anything else where something like this happens, you try to savor the moments. His work has been displayed in galleries all over New York and is selling for thousands of dollars. In a sense, the whole thing started randomly. But once it started snowballing, it just snowballed in a very nice fashion. He says a big reason for his success is his unusual canvas. I paint on paper towels. It holds the paint better and it's tougher and it absorbs everything quicker. Ken says he never planned to paint on paper towels until he noticed something unusual in his studio. I was turning off the lights and I looked at some of the paper towels that I used to clean my knives or brushes and the colors were just jumping out at me. What was going on is the two ply of the paper towel was grabbing the paint right off my brush. He says the other secret to his success is just letting go. When I forgot about trying to succeed as an artist and when I just started painting on what I wanted to paint on just for fun, suddenly new and different things started happening. that paint crushing enough hmm, something that's brilliant a stroke of brilliance uh, you hit a big last year how much do your paintings sell for now between 1800 and 10,000 <laughs> I, I think it's fantastic I love that you said that the colors just jumped out at you it leads me to my question about your success you you have a different philosophy on success yeah, if you try for it, you're going to miss. It's, it's a zen thing. Right. You just have to let it happen. You just relax and do your thing and pray. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Now, ever since I saw your video, I wanted to try painting on a paper towel. I am the daughter of an art teacher. Hey, Mom, she's in the dressing room. <laughs> I thought it'd be a little fun to do a, a little friendly competition here, though. Oh, yeah? Because, yeah, you see these uh, nice <laughs> easels and tripods set up here? Uh, before the show, Keaton, who's sitting right here in the front row, told my staff that she took some art classes in college. Uh, so she's going to help us out. Keaton, why don't you come on up here? Thank you. <laughs> All right. All right. Two beautiful women. I'm leaving. <laughs> <laughs> or you can paint us. It's fantastic. You can do this. <laughs> Don't be afraid, Kendelmar, OK? I have no fear. I will do you, and you will be beautiful. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to put 30 seconds on the clock. Each of us is going to try to do the best looking painting of a cat that we can. Does that sound good? Yeah. <laughs> okay, this will be your easel, Keaton. Wonderful. Ken, why don't you come? Oh, wait, a hang on. Ken, you, you sell your paintings for like $10,000. I think that gives you an unfair advantage. So I think you, you should paint this with a blindfold on. Oh, my God. You got to do it blindfolded. <laughs> I got to talk to my agent. <laughs> Two All hours right. in hair and makeup, there goes the hair. <laughs> the hair is perfect. Hey, wait, wait, I can't see. <laughs> feel, feel, yeah. feel. All right, I got All it. All right, you guys ready? No, I don't even have a brush. Oh. <laughs> you, you might need a brush. A there brush you go. brush is good, OK. And here, here's some paint. Paint, all right, great, of various great. colors. There it is. Oh, my God. <laughs> it's going to be just fine. All right, you ready? You set? Sure. Go. Brilliant. <laughs> Less is more. 
<laughs> From the moment I saw it, I knew it would be amazing. Keaton, let me see what you got here. <laughs> oh, Keaton. Look, did you see hers? Hers is, looks like a cat. It does. <laughs> Mine is a Picasso cat. <laughs> it's a Picasso. <laughs> it's a Picasso. There you go. Whoa. Well, Mine is. It's a chicken cat. It's kind of like it's got, it's got a bird body and a duck tail, and it has no face. I, I don't think any of us is going to get eighteen hundred dollars. So. You might, but I'll think we will. Thank you so much for playing Thank with you. us. I like it. I think yeah. it's going up. I'll tell you what, for being such a good sport, we're going to send you home with a one hundred dollar gift card from Michaels, so you can continue <laughs> practicing. Thank you so much for being such a good sport, Ken. Hey, for more of Ken's amazing work, please go to queenlatifah.com and keep living out loud. Right, Ken? Sounds good. That's what I'm talking about. We'll be right back. <laughs>